Located in London, Westminster Abbey is an Anglican church that holds an especially prominent place in the history of the English capital and the whole of the United Kingdom. It sits next to the British Parliament, Big Ben, and the Palace of Westminster, making it one of England's main tourist attractions, drawing more than a million people every year. According to legend, a man was once fishing in the River Thames when he caught sight of the figure of St. Peter near where he was standing. This was the reason the construction of Westminster Abbey began in 960 AD, when it was built by monks as a Benedictine monastery. King Edward the Confessor expanded the building in 1042, constructing a palace next to the abbey. But the present church, designed mainly in the Gothic style, started to be built in 1245 under Henry III and was consecrated in October 1267. It was originally a Catholic church, but Henry VIII established the Anglican Church in the 16th century. It joined this religious movement. Alongside these changes, Westminster Abbey has undergone restoration, damage, and reconstruction over the course of its long life. Some of its precincts and ceilings were hit by bombs during the Second World War, and a fire even broke out on the site. British monarchs have been crowned in Westminster Abbey since 1066. The first ceremony was that of William the Conqueror, and, since then, 39 other monarchs have been crowned there, the most recent being King Charles III in 2023. The King Edward's Chair, the throne on which the monarchs were crowned, is currently in St. Edward's Chapel, one of the Abbey's chapels. This throne is also of great significance to Scottish history, since 1301 until 1996, the Stone of Scone was laid beneath it. This artifact was used for a long time to crown Scottish monarchs and was later used to coronate monarchs from England and the Kingdom of Great Britain. The Stone of Scone is currently housed in Edinburgh Castle, in Scotland's capital. There have been many funerals in this church over the years, and approximately 3,300 people are buried there, among them some well-known personalities. For instance, the ashes of the brilliant astrophysicist Stephen Hawking are buried there, as well as the tombs of Isaac Newton and Charles Darwin. Thirty British monarchs are also buried in the Abbey, King Edward being the first ruler to be entombed there. Westminster Abbey also held Princess Diana's funeral when she died in 1997. Several weddings have been celebrated in the Abbey, such as that between Prince William and Kate Middleton in 2011. Benedict XVI, who visited the Abbey in 2010, became the first pope to set foot in the Abbey. The complex has numerous interesting areas worth mentioning. The Poet's Corner is where some of the great names of British literature have been honored, such as William Shakespeare, Oscar Wilde, and Jane Austen. The College Garden, a private abbey garden open to the public on some days of the week, is over 900 years old and is regarded as England's oldest park. The Chapter House, particularly distinguished by its geometric Gothic octagonal structure, is where monks and the abbot meet to say prayers and discuss important matters. This area was also used by Parliament during the 14th century. The well-known Tomb of the Unknown Soldier is the only spot in the Abbey where no one is allowed to walk, the burial site of a British fighter who died during the First World War and whose identity is unknown. British people and tourists pay here their respects to the soldiers who died in the war. Westminster Abbey is England's most important religious building and is still open today, holding daily masses and carrying out other religious duties. It has great historical, cultural, and tourist meaning, not only for the country in which it is located, but for the entire United Kingdom.